everyone welcome to my channel today is thrifty thursday hosted by sherry at turquoise streaming her channel and everything is listed down below i wanted to share with you um a recent yard sale trip that m my husband and i and my brother and sister-in-law took we went to trenton ohio they have a community-wide um, yard sale every third weekend in may and we went down and just rummaged around and had a really good time so i'm showing a little bit of the neat goodies that i saw there and then in a little bit i'll show you what i got stick around So I did get several things while I was at uh, Trenton, Ohio yard sale. Um, I'd like to show you some of the things for crafts that I got. Now, I did get things for school as well, but for this video, I'm just going to focus on my crafty goodies. Okay, I'm going to start right here since this is taking up so much space and I've got to get it off of my desk. Um, these right here are the type that you can get at Dollar Tree for $1.25 each. They're um, pencil cases. Now, I have never seen all of these colors. Um... I do have one that I bought at Dollar Tree over here that's gray. Um, that's this size. And then I've got some of the smaller ones um, that are clear or the buffalo check that I got at Dollar Tree. See how smaller that is? How much smaller? So I got these and they had 50 cents on them, but I was able to get all four for a dollar, which is so much cheaper than the dollar twenty-five tree. <laughs> so that was great, and I love the bright colors. So once again, these are pencil holders. Um, you can use it for other things. I'm I know, but that's what they're labeled as: is pencil holders, pen holders. All right, next up. I got um, a bundle deal. I just I found some books and some stickers, and um, some of the stickers have been used. She just had them laying there. There's actually just two here, but when you get in, there's another sheet full. And let's see, I got this there and this. think no I think hmm, that's right this is from another set all right I got these at the same place so that was a dollar <clears throat> and uh, yeah, I love these little note pads and um, journals a gratitude journal and a prayer journal. And they they had not been written in. Well, actually. Hmm. I guess they decided not to do it. I don't know. I thought it hadn't been written in. Let's see. Has this one been written in? Okay. No. 
I didn't think so. And then these notepads. One is, um, it has magnet and the other does not. So I got those. I do apologize. I'll be having to stop and start this video a bit to get out my coughs. I've, my allergies have killed me this year. And, um, I have a rough voice sounding because of coughing so much here in the past little bit. <clears throat> All right. Now, this one, like I said, it, it was just thrown in with some things that my husband got. I found them. And uh, so, yeah. See, I've got a whole nother pack here. And I probably gave maybe a quarter for all of this. I don't know. She might have gave it to me, really, when it comes right down to it. Okay. Next, I stopped at a place and was able to get... Um, this for a dollar. It's 31. It is a little bit dirty. Um, it's for makeup, but what I use them for, um, I use them for my, um, art journaling supplies and things like right here's one that I got at a yard sale last year. And, uh, let's see how I have it. I have my art journaling supplies in it. Um, it's easier to take my stuff, grab my stuff when it's like that. It's easier to just keep my stuff in things like this. And that way when I go somewhere, I can just grab the bags and, you know, take it with me. All right. I stopped at one yard sale and I saw these there. And I asked her how much she wanted for them. And she said she'd take a dollar for both. And I was like, okay. Now, I've got another thing at Oil Pastels over there that I haven't used yet. But, I just, yeah. See, this one is brand new. It's still in the package. So, I just couldn't pass it up. I don't know. And then here's Junior Artist. They're all in there. It's just they um, they don't stay very well in their little container. But anyway, I thought that was a good deal. I don't know. I've um, I don't have much experience with oil pastels, but. Sounded good to me. All right. At another place I stopped at, she had quite a bit of scrapbooking material. Scrapbooking things. And um, I was able to get few things. I don't remember exactly. I want to say I got this for a dollar and then I got this for a dollar. Now, I already have one of these. Let me see. Two. Okay. See, there's mine. But it's almost used up. So, I really got it for this, but this got thrown in with it. So, I took it, but I got that for a dollar. Pretty sure I got this for a dollar. I can't remember. We stopped at so many. Um, I should have kept a running, running log of what I spent, but I thought this was really cool. It's a calendar kit, so you've got your calendar days, um, backgrounds, which I won't do a calendar. 
I don't think. But I do like that for like um, just a background of something. Then we've got um, papers. So there's winter and Valentine's. So that would have been January, the winter one. March, April. Yes, May, June, July, August, September. So it's got um, two sheets for each month, October, November, and December. And then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten solid sheets. Um, this is just a, I think, a protective paper for this. So January, February, the stickers, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. So I got that. I'm pretty sure I got that for a dollar. Maybe two dollars, but nothing over that. Okay, and another lady's place, I got some clothes. She had several, but I only got this one, and it was five. She let me have it for three. It's the geometric background stamps flare. The others were more, um, you know, specific, like for card making, um, words and things and I have a whole lot of that already for um for card making and specialized cards and things from my um stamp it up days stamping up days <laughs> so yeah those are pretty cool looking I thought these would be cool on my um jelly jelly printing I got these for 50 cents. They're just finger um, protection, silicon finger sleeves for like if I'm using um, hot glue gun or something like that. I'm all the time burning myself, so I thought that would be good to have for 50 cents. Then I stopped at this one yard sale. And here's where it gets so, so wonderful. Not that any of that stuff was not wonderful. But I stopped at this lady's yard sale that was a former teacher. And so she had all kinds of interesting things for teaching. And she had taught, I think she said kindergarten. And I thought that was interesting and fun. So she had all these books, and I could have spent forever and a day there going through the books. But I have a ton of books already at school, so I'm looking for more um, specialized things like STEM um, kits and things of that nature. Um, and her husband, he had a lot of old papers and things. So, of course, I went crazy there as well. <laughs> so, we went to this yard sale twice. On Saturday, it was regular price. And then on Sunday, they had it 50% off. So, I'm going to show you what I got Saturday. And then I'll show you what I got Sunday. So, Saturday, this did have a dollar sticker on it. I don't know what happened to it, but I got this for a dollar. I have not even opened it up to see what all's in it. Uh, she had a bunch of games. So these are vintage bingo games. <clears throat> bingo cards. And it's like 
but see, it's that kind. It's got those. And she's got what they're missing, which, you know, that doesn't bother me at all because, you know, what I'm going to be using these for. So there's um, a couple of sets, it looks like, in here. We've got the ones that look like this. Nice. Ones that look like this. Um, that's more this way. There's a blue. Oh no, there's only this one blue. Look at that. No, right here's some blue. That's fantastic, isn't it? And I got this for a dollar. A dollar. Um, look at that. The um, rubber bands are falling apart. Okay. Where's that bag? Actually, I'm going to take it out of this bag because this bag is so um, colored, different colored. It looks kind of gross. And put it in this 31 bag. I did not take a purse. I've just about got to where I don't carry a purse at all anymore. And I was like, <clears throat> if I can find me a backpack, a little backpack that will be great and I did I found a 31 brand new backpack for three dollars and that's where I carried the rest of the, the trip we went down there on Friday and we um, we yard sale we went around to the yard sales Friday Saturday and Sunday <clears throat> Letting my baby in. He's wanting to be part of it. It's been a while since he's been filmed. Yeah. He's been here. Say hi to everyone. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Say hi, everybody. She also had these, um, one, two, three, four, a dollar fifty is what I have in this, um, orange, hot pink, orange, blue, hot pink, turquoise. <laughs> I'm going to take these to school probably and let the kids use these. I don't know exactly what all I'm going to do with those yet. I brought them in here to show because I did get some uh, teaching supplies there too, but I brought those in here just because at another place I got some stamps and I'm going to show you the stamps. I may keep them here. I may take them to school. I don't know, but here's the papers that I got. Now, everything was a quarter. So these are... Um, Let's see, these are grade uh, cards, report cards. And I just love this, look, that you can, it, it's like graft. <laughs> so I guess this is A plus and that would be an A minus. Oh, didn't make up lessons when absent. Fourth 
great. Okay. Marion County, Ohio. I don't see it year. Hmm. Let's see. Fifth grade. Sixth grade. These are all the same people. Seven. That's a different person. This is 1959. 10th grade. There were several report cards. I didn't get them all. I just grabbed a few. 9th grade. Okay, this is a different person. And they let all of this go. I said, it's all in this envelope. And he said, it's okay. It's all a quarter. So, what we got here? I don't even know. Oh. A diploma. This is a high school diploma. Given this 11th day of June, 1957. I hate that it's been bent. Let's see, we got eleventh grade. School service cards. Hmm. Home report. Cincinnati Cincinnati Public Schools. Oh, here's the primary. Grade one, two, and three. Very cool. Four, five, and six. I think these are all the, all the way up to his graduating. How cool is that? All right, let's see. Honor scholarship certificate. Progress report card. Special honor card. By your Daughter Jean. <laughs> okay, I got these. Um, the Confederate States of America. I don't know much about this. Um, it says copy on here. Does that mean that this is a copy or that the name is copy? I don't, it's probably, these are probably just copies. Let's see, copy. They're still cool to look at, I think. Um, I just thought that was gorgeous. The Queen's Drawing Room. Queen Victoria. Look at this pretty dresses. Six new pictures. Um, all these. And these are still offered. You may get any of the above by following the directions below. Cut the name McLaughlin's from the face of 15 coffee package wrappers. Oh, here's some more of William's report cards. Super developing surface. Okay, I thought this was cool. This is uh, for your film. Some more of this. Um... Wow, one million dollars in gold. <laughs> oh. 
Now say this one doesn't have anything on it, but this one does. Oh, baby. I know one thing, it's stirring up my allergies, this dust. George Ferguson, 1952, 1953, grades three, four, five, and six. So let's see, I wonder what grade he was in. Does it say? It does not say. Grade four. Hmm. Okay. I just think these are so cool. And then I got this book there for a quarter as well. I spent eight dollars at this place the first time. So <clears throat> this is 1983 Old Birds back section <laughs> breeding record book. So this is the pairs that's when they're they're mated of chickens. I just think this is so cool. And um so they've kept up with when they've mated certain pairs of chickens and what they've got. Now, I don't have any idea about chickens. I don't know about their numbers or whatever. So, can chickens be um, licensed like dogs? I don't know nothing about this. But about half of it is written in, and then the other half is not as detailed, and then it's not written in at all. So whoever did the first ones, like, really kept up with the um, information. If anybody knows about chickens, you might know more about this than I do. But I thought it was cool. So that was my first day. And then when I went back the second day and it was 50 cents, I got a few more things. So I got, not 50 cents, I'm sorry, it was 50% off. I got this. It says suddenly it's spring. I don't know how I missed this the first time. But it's hard to do this in one handed, it just opens. <clears throat> I think it's something about a high school program put on because it says West, the West Division Council of Niles Township High School presents Suddenly It's Spring Music by Laney, Laney Brast in his blue notes, Saturday evening, March 29th, 1958, 8.30 to 11.30. And then, let's go two of them. And acknowledgements, dance committee, and I got the S. It had a dollar on it, but I got it for half a 25 cents, so 12.5 cents. Just a picture, a cardboard picture. Now, I thought this would be cool to take at school and use 101 devices for seat work. Um, rearrange letters from words. Rearrange the letters in these words to spell different words. Write all the words to you know containing. So this is not really um, kindergarten, but there's some things here that you can do with kindergartners. 
tell what the following like to eat. A spider, a bird, a fly, a mouse, a hen, a horse, a dog, a cat. Here we go. What is the matter with a boy who cannot hear? What is the matter with a boy who cannot see? What is the matter with a boy who cannot speak? What is the matter with a boy who cannot walk? Tell ten things the rain is good for. Tell ten things the wind is good for. Count to 100 by twos. Count to 100 by fives. Count to 100 by tens. And so on. Have children trace around leaves, cut them out, and mount on tinted paper. Tell what you would do with a quarter if you found one. <laughs> Make a list of the clothing you wore to school today. These are great ideas. And not necessarily, we don't have to sit and let them talk. Uh, write, they can talk it out. And that will help with their uh, vocabulary. Then I got these, Courier and Ives. American Homestead Summer. American Homestead Winter, Winter, not Winter, <laughs> American Homestead in Spring, and American Homestead in Autumn. I liked these. Once again, I don't know how I missed these the day before, but I really stood there and dug this day, which I did the other day. <laughs> um, the Carols of Christmas. I think these are nice. Would be pretty in a, a Christmas journal. This is another coffee um, card. I don't know much about them, but they are pretty cool. American Views. I don't know. I don't remember grabbing this one. Oh, yes, I do. For these Kansas City, Boston, New York. Um, so they've got the like town hall, custom house, post office, Cincinnati, New Orleans, Kansas City, San Francisco, St. Louis, Chicago, Niagara Falls and so on and so forth and what have you. Say in the comments if you know what that's off of. <laughs> okay, I love this when I seen it. So this is a penmanship notebook. So other books in this classic curriculum are McGuffey reading series, Razor arithmetic series, um, originally published in 1874, republished in 1985. So it's not very old, but it's still pretty cool. Okay, so here's the rest. And I just loved it because I teach penmanship and I just think that is the coolest thing. Okay. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I had forgotten to show these. I did get these at Trenton, Ohio. So we've got stamps of the Disney princesses and like carriage and just a castle, um, just a lot of different, you know, like they're different, so. There's the rose. I don't know if I'm gonna keep these here at the house or if I'm gonna take them to school. I haven't decided yet. And that was all, I believe, from the Trenton yard sale. 
lot of good things. Lots of good things. Thanks so much for joining me for this Thrifty Thursday. Again, be sure to check out Sherry's channel linked in the description box. Have a blessed, crafty day. Bye-bye.